Quack! Hello and welcome. My name is Ben from Skinny Fat Duck, and this is Final Fantasy, and this is the brand new version that literally, literally just launched on Steam uh, just a couple of hours ago. I have been incredibly excited to uh, to dive into this. Obviously, as a fan of RPGs, I have well. I've grown up with Final Fantasy, uh, Final Fantasy 2 for the Super Nintendo, otherwise known as Final Fantasy 4, was one of the very first games I ever played, and definitely uh, one of the first RPGs I ever played, and ever since then, um, I have been a fan of at least the retro side of uh, the series, uh, the newer games not so much. But either way, I thought, uh, what better way to start than, but at the beginning. So with that in mind, we are going to go ahead and jump into this. If you like what you see, we would definitely appreciate you considering subscribing and, uh, you know, all that, all that jazz. So we definitely appreciate you being here. So we got some basic control settings here. I'm just going to leave that alone. Uh, let's see. Bunch of different options. I think I'm just going to leave everything as is right now. And I think one of the first things people are going to wonder about is whether they can change the, uh, change the font. And it doesn't appear that there's a way to do that. However... At least at this point, it actually doesn't look as bad as it did in the pictures, so I'm hopeful. So, let's see how we want to do this. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to have a warrior. We're going to go ahead and just name... Oh, I may have to do this on the keyboard. No. No. Um, hmm. One moment. There we go. Okay. I'm not sure how you're supposed to do that with a controller. Anyway. Gonna name him Ness. Gonna name the white mage Paula. And as far as the other characters, I think I want a red mage who shall be named none other than Jeff. And lastly, we'll have a monk. And as most of you have probably already figured out, I'm going to name him Pooh. All right, Ness, Paula, Jeff, Pooh. Let's get this show on the road. The world lies shrouded in darkness. Wow, this, this was kind of unexpected. The winds die. The seas rage. Earth decays. But the people believe in a prophecy, patiently awaiting its fulfillment. When darkness veils the world, four warriors of light shall come. 
After a long journey, four young travelers did at last appear. And in the hand of each was clutched a crystal. Oh, man. When that music hits. Okay, so... Uh, yeah, that was kind of cool. I wasn't really expecting that introduction. Now, they may have done that in other versions of this game, but I'll be, uh, you know, full disclosure. This is probably the one, uh, the least played retro Final Fantasy for, for me. Um, I have beaten it, but it's been a long time ago. Uh, so... That introduction may have been in one of the other versions, but again, I, I wouldn't know. So anyways, I thought it was cool. And this game looks really nice. Just going to go ahead and say right off the bat. I'm really digging these graphics. All right, so let's go ahead and get started. This is Cornelius, the City of Dreams. I'd be most happy to teach you about equipment. Would you care to listen? Uh, I mean, I don't think this is necessary, but we'll go ahead and listen to this one. Equipment can... Okay. Yeah, four types of armor. Any armor you wear in your body, including armaments. Yep. Remember that weapons and armor you find won't do any good unless you equip them. Selecting optimal. Okay. Let's just see what the other topics are. Use of magic. You know what? For people that haven't played this game, this may be useful, so I'll go ahead and listen to this one. There are two schools of magic, black and white. White magic is comprised of healing and defensive spells, spells while black magic spells are the offensive variety. Each level of black and white magic contains four distinct spells. However... Any given character can learn and only learn three of the four spells of a particular magic level. You can use forget command to wipe your memory of any spell you've previously learned. Want to relearn a spell you've previously forgotten? You can do that too. Try to choose a combination of spells that works well for your, with your fighting style. So what I'll be curious to see about is, um, oh, there's a dash also. Oh, and there's uh, all axis moving. I wasn't expecting that. That's cool. Uh, but um, what I'll be curious to see is what kind of bugs and stuff are left intact. Because I want to say, as with most original Final Fantasy games, there are quite a few like broken or useless spells and uh, even stats that don't work right, so I'll be curious to see how everything works in this one. Would you like to tarry for just a moment to hear about monsters? Sure. Many types of monsters, different types have different weaknesses. Finding a monster's weakness will gain you upper hand. Yeah, aquatic monsters hate lightning, casting thunder. Some weapons are more effective, which makes sense. You need to know about items. Uh, we, I think, I think everybody here gets the idea. Let's just go ahead. How much money we got? And I'm pretty sure everybody starts, yeah, with pretty basic stuff. Oh, nice. So it's got a CRT filter also. That's pretty cool. Okay, so you got some auto battle features, which, you know what? The fact that it's an option is nice because if you're if you're a purist and you don't want to deal with it, that's totally fine. Um, 
initials imp initial impressions on this this font because if you haven't been looking online uh, a lot of people have had an had an issue with it um to be honest i mean seeing seeing it you know firsthand in in motion it's i mean it's easy to read it may be a little bit jarring with uh with this particular style or or the aesthetics um but as far as readability and stuff i mean it's not bad um you know however my opinion may change later take a peek at the, your reflection in the water Ugh, you're filthy use time to wash up hi there i'm a dancer what's that you want to dance with me hee <laughs> hee Store the crystals to grace. It's a well. It looks like you could climb inside, but you can't. Really. Um. So typically what I'll do is go ahead and buy armor first. Oh, and it also has weight, so I'm assuming that affects speed. Um, wow. All right, let's just go ahead. Oh, and it looks like we're going to have enough. May have, well, we probably won't have enough for spells if I spend everything. Oh, it only costs eight? Like, are you kidding me? Okay. Now, I wonder if staves or staffs make, um, let's see. It only says attack plus six, but I'm not sure if it affects, like, spell damage or anything. But we'll just have to see. We'll just go ahead and equip all of our stuff. Alright, there's that. I once lived far to the east of here in the harbor city of Provoca. These days I heard I hear it's turned into a pirate's den. The king is searching for the prophesied warriors of light. Th those crystals, you must see the king at once. Ah, crap. Welcome, travelers. I'm told you carry crystals. Is this true? It's just as Lucan's prophecy foretold. When darkness fails the world, four warriors of light shall come. Your Majesty, we cannot be certain that these are the warriors foretold by the prophecy. Even though we got crystals? Okay, buddy. Yet they... Oh, he said it. All right. Yet they stand before us with the crystals. I cannot dismiss this as a mere coincidence. Crystal bearers, there's a task I would ask of you. We rescue you, my daughter, Sarah. Garland, a knight once in his ma majesty's service, has abducted Princess Sarah. I ask for your aid in the name of his majesty, the King of Cornelia. Garland has taken refuge in the Chaos Shrine, which lies to our north. Of course, we did attempt to save the princess ourselves, but Garland is the finest swordsman in the kingdom. We have none who can match him. I've heard that you wish to journey to the continent to our north. The bridge leading north was lost long ago, making passage impossible. If you can rescue Sarah, I will have the bridge rebuilt as a token of my gratitude. Go now, warriors of light, and do not fail me. The dancing girl in town knows many odd bits of information. If you find yourself astray, try talking to her. She may so know something that can put you back on course. Warriors of Light have come at last. How long have we, we have waited for this day to come? Merlin is no longer the man I once knew. I beg of you, please return my daughter to me quickly. Let's we'll see what we can do. Reports say that Garland fled north with the princess to the Chaos Shrine. 
already digging the speed up function. I'd be curious if it works in dungeons too, because it seems a little bit OP. But I suppose that with this remaster, they're kind of, you know, bringing it into the modern, the modern era. So, her majesty's, her majesty's overcome with grief. She shut herself inside her chamber, chambers. Please try to not to upset her. I don't know why I can't talk today. I am Jane, Queen of Cornelia. Please, please bring my daughter, my Sarah, back to me safely. One thing I did want to check. So it doesn't look like you can change. I mean, I don't know. Part of me expected that they would give a toggle to like, uh, to change the graphics to the original or the music to the original, but it doesn't look like you can. That said, I'm not disappointed by the music at all so far. And the graphics look good, so that's fine. Garland was once the greatest knight in the kingdom, but power consumed him and he lost sight of who he really was. Please, please save La Lady Sarah. My sister. I want my sister. All right, we'll see what we can do. I don't think there's anything else we can get to. I know that there's some treasure back here, but I think you have to have... Uh, we have to have some kind of item to get it, so I'm not even going to fool with it. At, well, just go around and see. There may be... There may be something we can use now and something later. Honestly, don't remember. Our ancestors sealed weapons within this treasure room 400 years ago. They then gave the key to the Elf King to hold until the coming of the Warriors of Light. Okay. So, yeah, we're not going to be able to get into that. All right. So before we go see our boy Garland... We need to continue exploring the town. Sage Lucan said something about finding the crescent moon, then he just up and left town. Oh, please, you must rescue the princess. All right. Let's go ahead and get a fire. Thunder. Um... I guess sleep, I don't know. Well, we can always change it. Well, let's get the uh, white magic first. Oh, cause he's only gonna have three slots. All right. Um, well, we definitely want cure on both. Let's go ahead and get the, uh, I'm pretty sure that's relatively, uh, powerful. I've already talked, yeah, I've already talked to them. So I think we're good. There are none in need of my services. I guess you can't play the piano. All right. Oh, I didn't even notice the icons on the mini-map. That's kind of cool. But I think we're all set to head towards Garland's domain. All right. Wow, seemed like there was a little lag there. Easy enough. Yeah, you can definitely tell this is a modernized version of the game because uh, by now on any other version, you would have uh, ran into a hundred different random encounters. Oh, that's cool.
I guess we can go ahead and go inside. And it looks like you can run. All right, let's see what Dia can do. Didn't even really need to use it. Yeah, it uh, completely wrecked him. Store has been secured with the Mystic Key, so that's the key that the elf, the Elven leader has. Oh. Okay, so it looks like auto battle does save your cursor. So I need to go ahead and attack. There we go. Jeez, a werewolf stout. I guess it can only heal one person? I'm not entirely sure. It appears that way. We should be good now. Well, I say that. Yeah, I didn't even pick up any items, too, but I guess I didn't... I wouldn't have had enough cash anyways. All is already out of magic. And I don't have any antidotes. So that could be a problem on the way back. Go ahead and get the get rid of the rest of these guards. I do like what I'm seeing so far uh, in combat, as far as graphics go. Yeah, and I'm completely out of heals. Um, I've been told, or at least I've read, that the backdrops are like a uh, re repurposed version of the uh, Game Boy Advance versions, I want to say. I could be making that up completely, but yeah, we... Oh, this is not good. Yeah, this is... I may have just screwed myself up. Hopefully I can run. Uh oh. Yeah, I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to make it. Oh, this is, yeah, this is gonna be very telling. God, I can't believe this is happening. Party was defeated. And I haven't saved. Oh, it auto-saved. Well. Lesson learned. My gosh. So, what I will do instead... Is... I guess I should grind a little bit. Just a little bit. But 
But yeah, as I was saying about the graphics, um, the backdrop, the battle backdrops appear to be from um, repurposed from the Game Boy Advance version. And uh, yeah, I mean they look they look impressive. The new graphics look impressive. I I really have no complaints about this so far. And of course. I don't know. I mean, save by the auto save. I'm sure. Uh, I'm sure I'm gonna get some crap for that. But uh, <laughs> rest assured, uh, you know, I'm not gonna let it happen again. At least I hope it doesn't. So okay, we're we're accruing some money. But yeah, it serves me right to just kind of walk in there without any any kind of plan got another level up and in case you were curious and you haven't played this game before there's not really MP even though it says it right there it's more of like a charge based system and the higher level you get the more charges you have so it's not quite the same. You have to be a little bit more methodical about how you how you use uh, use magic, because it's not quite as accessible. I guess you could see. You see, as of right now, Jeff and Paula can use level one magic three times before they're before they're out and have to be recharged. All right, let's go ahead and pick up. That's all I have money for. Jeez, how do the weapon and armor shops keep their doors open? Well, I mean, when you look at the items in comparison, how much markup they have, and then you're selling a dagger for two gold, like, doesn't make any sense. All right, so let's just keep doing our thing here. I may may dip my toes into the uh, into the chaos shrine, and the more that I think about it, I don't know why I was going around the entire thing because I'm pretty sure all of those doors are are locked and you can't get to them. In fact, what we may do is just go ahead and, uh, ooh. That was a heavy hit. May just go ahead and face Garland here. Or you know what, I'll get one more level and then we'll fight him. Maybe I should get it out here. But yeah, I'm pretty sure all of the, the extra doors are locked. I could be wrong. Once we've built up a little bit more, I'll definitely check all of them. I still can't believe I died. That's so embarrassing. Like RPG 101. Don't walk into a place without antidotes. That's okay. Be sure to let me know how bad of a gamer I am in uh, in the comments below. I would appreciate it. All right, so we got another level. Let's just go ahead and heal her up. Jeez, Jeff has such little health. All right, we'll go ahead and face the man himself. The king will have no choice but to exchange the kingdom for his daughter's life. Cornelia will be mine. Who's there? Hmm, the king's lapdogs. Do you have any idea who you're messing with? You really think you have what it takes to cross swords with me? 
Very well. I, Garland, will knock you all down. Probably the best line beside uh, Spoony Board in the entire series. And this, this guy are sick. That one's pretty good, too. All right, I'm going to defend... Oh, good. Miss. Thunder didn't do that much. Yeah, it didn't do much at all. So far, so good. And we got this one in the bag. Oh, and it has the Final Fantasy IV death, death sound effect. That's interesting. Or not Final Fantasy. I think it's Final Fantasy IV. Could be wrong. You've come to rescue me? I am Sarah, Princess of Cornelia. Words could never be enough to thank you. It's the first time anyone's ever defeated Garland. You must allow me to show my gratitude. Please, accompany, to, accompany me to Castle Cornelia. I. You know, it's kind of funny that Garland would take the princess to the only other location that is accessible on that island. Like, like as if it's like a big secret or anything. Like, it sound, seems kind of odd. Thank you for returning my daughter to my side. There could be no doubt that you were the warriors of light from Lucan's prophecy. You should hear the prophecy in its entirety. Entirety, <clears throat> if I may. When the darkness fails the world, four warriors of light shall come. If they cannot gather the shards of light, the darkness will consume all. The four crystals will never shine again. Now, I hear that a crystal can be found on the continent to our north. Storing light to the crystals is our only hope of ridding the world of the monsters which plague it. I will have the bridge to the north rebuilt, as I promised. Pray that you succeed in restoring light to the four crystals and to the world. Yay! All right, wait just a moment. This loot has been entrusted to the princesses of Cornelia for many generations. When he abducted me, Garland took this loot as well. I want you to have it. it. May aid you on your journey. We obtained the loot. All right. And with that, I think that's going to do it for this episode. Uh... What I may do is just just a small, minor amount of grinding just to get a, a little bit of a stock built up as far as items go. I may go back to the Chaos Shrine and make sure all the doors are closed. Um, and so that will kind of set us up to continue this in the next episode. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a like. Consider subscribing. Definitely helps us out. I'll be back with episode two soon. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.